Okay, we have a Dolly milling and boring machine model DLV 1600. Seal number 160186. Machine was new in 1988. Machine has a 20 by 87 table, 63 inches of X travel, 24 of Y. The spindle goes up and down 28 inches. And it also has a three inch horizontal quill travel uh, with a seven inch diameter. We're going to uh, run it for you. Demonstrate the quill, which is manual. It's bringing it in, bringing it out. Okay, we're gonna run it for you. Right now we're running at a low RPM. The horizontal spindle has from 110 up to 840 RPM. Nice and quiet. Okay, how much? 800. 800, that's the, one of the top speed. Very quiet. That's the vertical spindle. Again, both spindles are 50 taper. The vertical spindle has a power drawbar. Spindle brake. The, the vertical spindle has from 60 up to 1720 RPM. Okay. Break. Break. Okay. It's a higher speed. Spindle break. Right now we're moving the which axes? The Z up and down. You can see also there the handle's turning. The Z up. That's the vertical head of the, the, the horizontal head up and down. The other Z. Yep. They, they switch when you switch. Yes. Cross feed, you can see the, the table, uh, the handle turning, and also you can see it on the digital readout. Let it go for a little bit so that you can see. And the table X. And you can see it moving there. Could you also, it's variable, right? No. Oh, it was geared, okay. All right, so you saw the X, Y, and Z of the, of the, uh, the X and Y of the table, and you saw the Z of the head up and down, plus the Z of the horizontal spindle head up and down. Uh, we also manually moved the quill out. And you saw the digital readout work for both X, X and Y of the table and Z of both heads. Hey, thank you for watching our video.